This is Mox's Story Share Project, a collection of stories from people who are striving for a community free from sexual assault and abuse. The theme for this project is My Moment, Our Momentum. Listen now to this moment. My name is Jennifer Green. I have been a sexual assault nurse examiner for over 12 years. Over the course of that past 12 years, I have witnessed profound strides in community response and supports available for those who have experienced sexual assault, making this an exciting time to be in this field. I did not intend to be a sane or a forensic nurse. My first profession was a high school art teacher. Soon after starting that career, I started a family and had four kids in five years, making daycare triple what I was making. My twin sister, Karen, who's also a nurse, recommended I work in a hospital nights or weekends as a unit secretary to save money. I was honest and upfront when I interviewed with St. Luke South for a weekend position in admitting representative. As an art education major, I knew nothing about the medical world, but the clinical staff, nurses, techs, doctors, they fostered my interest and encouraged me. When I say encouraged me, I mean they pushed me to go back to school. After graduating nursing school, my first job was in the medical intensive care unit at St. Luke's Hospital. I learned volumes and developed confidence in my skills, but there was a constant pull and a desire to return to the ER. So I went back to St. Luke's South to work as a night staff nurse in the ER. On my second week of orientation, an ambulance brought a 15-year-old girl that was found unconscious at a party. When she woke, she told me she had fragmented memories of being sexually assaulted at the party by a peer. I had heard about kits and knew that there's evidence that could be collected for the crime lab, but had no idea how to collect one. As I mentioned before, I had developed confidence working in the ICU, and I had taken care of some of the sickest patients in the city, but I was particularly uncomfortable not being able to take care of this patient the way she deserved. A nurse came down from the OB department who had been trained as a SANE to show me how to conduct the exam. That lit a spark inside me. In the days and weeks following that exam, that spark grew to a fiery desire to provide every patient who has experienced a sexual assault the care they deserve. I signed up for the next SANE training and within three years was managing the KC SANE program at Truman Medical Center. Since 2015, I have been back with St. Luke's as the clinical forensic care program manager and completed a master's of science in nursing with a specialization in forensic nursing. Thank you for listening to Mox's Story Share. With your help, we can change our culture to one where survivors are believed, perpetrators are held accountable, and our community is safer. If you would like to get involved or need support, please go to moxa.org. That's moxa, M-O-C-S-A dot O-R-G. Or call us at 816-531-0233, anytime, 24 hours a day.